Hi, I'm Liz Drury from Liz Drury VoiceOvers, and this is video number four in a series of five short videos on how to make really great voicemail greetings. So in previous videos, we've looked at why you should have a voicemail greeting. We've looked at what should go into your voicemail greeting. And in the last video, I gave you a really simple tip to make you sound really approachable and friendly. Now, today's tip is about having your ideal client in mind when you're recording your voicemail greeting. So maybe you've already worked with an ideal client and you could think of them while you're reading your script out. Maybe you haven't worked with your ideal client yet, but you've got an idea of who they would be. And maybe you're really not sure, but you could think of a famous person that you'd really like to sell your product or service to. Have them in mind while you deliver your script. Now, if you have trouble keeping uh, that picture in your imagination, print a picture out and have that in front of you while you're recording your script and you'll be surprised what a difference it makes. You'll sound really approachable and friendly because you'll be smiling like we talked about before, but also you're going to be giving that message to the person that you really want to hear it. You're going to be talking to your ideal audience and your ideal audience are going to pick up on that. So that's my tip for today. Look out for the last video, number five, coming soon, when I will give you one final tip on how to make a really great voicemail greeting. Uh, if you're enjoying these videos and you'd like to be reminded of all the things I've said, then do download my free PDFs. Just follow the link below.